Fortunately, sea otters love the cold. Many of Earth's creatures wait for warmer spring days to breed, but not the otters. They give birth when the sea is at its coldest. In the aquatic maternity ward are a ragtag collection of pups of different ages. This six week old was born during winter's first cold snap. Safe on his mother's belly, he gets acquainted to the world around him. Teenagers play fighting are the most entertaining. Mum knows her pup is not ready for such rough play. She agrees to give him a little independence. It gives her a chance to attend to an important task. Her fur is the densest of any animal on Earth. Double layered with over 150,000 hairs per square centimeter. Grooming releases natural oils from the skin to keep her coat waterproof. She checks if her son's picking up some tips. Not bad. Primping done, hunger calls. Her pup's too young to join her hunting, but he can't be left to drift alone. So she ties him up for safekeeping. Sea otters use kelp strands to anchor themselves in the swell and to keep unattended pups from floating away. Mind at ease. Mum takes the plunge to forage in the kelp beds below. Winter's nutrient-rich waters swirl up from the deep and flow into Monterey Bay's submarine canyon. Countless marine creatures thrive, including this spiny army. Sea urchins eat kelp. Thankfully, sea otters eat urchins. Mussels are also on the sea food buffet. sea otter takes her time foraging and returns to the surface clutching her favorite meal, butter clams. This was a good haul. Hunger served, she looks for her pup. He is untethered from his kelp, but thankfully, his fluffy fur acts as a life vest. She gathers him onto her belly, safely back where he belongs.